Ooh, look at that breast. Rub those breasts together, baby. Hey, hey, that's, are you breast, a on, that's breast on breast action. Hey, are, are, you guy, are you a breast guy or a thigh guy or a wing guy? <laughs> everything guy. What's going on YouTube and what's up Basos fam and today we are doing a Filipino traditional dish called chicken adobo However, there's a catch. We are doing it without a recipe going in blinded. Wish us luck Hopefully it's not gonna be too salty and it starts right now Can you dice the garlic? Yeah, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> hey! Look at this. Uh, you have to spot like this. Like part. that. That's ready? That's the people's way. Yeah, bro. Ready. Are you getting <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we are doing the marinade of just the meat right now. It is uh, not quite the recipe. Um, Hashtag without a recipe. So uh, we're prepping the meat, getting ready for the actual dish itself. So tune in as we give you the ins and outs of our ins and outs. <laughs> the ins and outs of our ins and outs. <laughs> Damn, look at this freaking meat, bro. Is that a good angle? Let's go, Luis. Ooh, that's what I like is that the little chips of garlic just like just drift over time. Bro. Oh. Right there. Yes, yes, Daddy. Yes. Right there, right there, right there, right there, right there, right there. Ooh, so basta spa boys. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, I'm done. <laughs> Ooh. Give me that lechon, baby. Look at that sauce. It's sopping with it. Is. Yeah. Oh. Just a little foreplay there. A little rub rub. A little food porn. Wet wet with the rub rub. Ooh, I might have to use a whole bottle. <laughs> yes. Let's lube that up, baby. Might have to lube it up. All right, Bossos fam, we are working on the marinade for the meat alone, just the chicken. So what we've done so far was threw a bunch of calamansi in there, a bunch of garlic, and uh, some oyster sauce. So now Glenn is in the process of beating that meat <laughs> until uh, until it gets uh, so tender, so tender, you know. So um, it's gonna be good. So that is the final step of this marinade process. And the rest of the recipe and the video will be coming your way. And we will go into that blind. Yeah. So stay tuned, everybody. Bye, boys and bye, Mets. Yeah. 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 So, yeah a little bit of soy sauce. So that chicken is simmering, yeah, man. Bro. Look at that. Look at that. Just, just getting there. So again, all that is is just our chicken with its special marinade and vinegar, right? That's it. That's, That's it. it, man. And then we're going to throw in the good stuff later, mm -hmm. which is our onions, the bay leaves. You know, you know, the crazy thing about this is that we, we we're either on point on the process or we're way off. Or we're way off. <laughs> so, so either way, it's the end result, right? It depends on how it tastes and, and how it turns out. So yeah. uh, there, there are many ways to skin a cat. In this case, we're going blind. We don't know. And I think that's the great thing about uh, knowing what's going into your recipe, but not sure what's coming out of it. <laughs> so I think this is great, right? Like we're just kind of winging it, but at the same time, we know the basics of this uh, adobo recipe. We know the ingredients. And like the really good chefs out there, they, they don't really need to measure anything. No. They're just like, you know, throw this, throw that, throw this. So, mm -hmm. well, think about it. Think about it, Alan. Rambo, when you guys are growing up and your parents are cooking, right? Did they ever tell you like how much of what goes into the I, have, I don't think I've ever seen my, my mom pull out like a measuring cup. Yeah. It's just like- Eyeball. 
Use you know. your ice. Yeah. Sweat. So, um, yeah, so we'll see. I think, again, the, the big kicker for us is going to be the soy sauce. How much saltiness are we going to throw into that? You know, what does, you know, a tablespoon, a cup, what will it do to transition or, or to affect our dish? So. All right, and so now we're going to add some black pepper to this concoction. So far we have the chicken breast, the marinated chicken breast, and we added a little bit of vinegar in there. So um, when you say vinegar, how much vinegar did you add? <laughs> I have no clue. Half you just a cup? Uh, Three four? cups? Four? I have no four idea. Four Enough to put a little stink on it. <laughs> so make it extra sour. Yeah, just a little bit. So um, we are. Uh, and again, the the key here uh, is look what Alan was saying is that we don't want to make it too salty, you know. And that's where it's going to be a fine line that, that we're going to have to tread with the soy sauce because just a little bit of that will add a lot. Think about it. Yeah. Should we add water? What do you guys think? I don't know. Cause For me, when I've made it, I've never put water. It's all soy sauce and all vinegar. But hey, we're doing it the pasta spa boys way, which is we just wing it. Yeah, we're literally winging it. <laughs> so I think the idea is that we're going to add the onions a little bit later. Make sure they get uh, soft and add a little bit of flavor. And, and maybe then, throw the bay leaves after, let it yeah, simmer let it for a while. Hey, can you show a picture of your bay leaves? Because they are not the, the dried bay leaves, these are fresh bay leaves. These are fresh bay leaves. If you can get the color there, it's, a, it's green. They're green. <laughs> Check it out. Oh yeah, those are huge, man. Yeah. That's those what she, are like... That's what she said. Are those mandingo leaves or what? They're not black though. They are freaking green, man. So fresh from the tree. So I'm gonna get a cover to cover this up. What are we gonna do now? Is this ready? Yeah. Did you, you wash it? Yep, I washed it three fingers. times. Middle finger, like that. Oh, wait. this one here. Did you put the line here? Oh, you told me. You ban it. You ban. I don't know, man. So, oh, no. so right now, uh, I guess oh, the, that's not enough water. the adobo recipe is pretty straightforward, right? You, you, so you far, do the vinegar, bay leaves, which will come in the latter part of it. But right now, the key is to cook down this chicken uh, with the vinegar. The good thing with our chicken uh, marinade, uh, it was simmering for a little bit over an hour in the refrigerator with just oyster sauce, calamansi, and garlic. So. That should bring out some crazy flavors. And now to add to our collection is the uh, vinegar. So hopefully it's enough. If it's not, we'll see. So again, we are doing a chicken adobo recipe uh, without a recipe. We're going into this blinded, blindfolded. Uh, we are just guessing. So if you guys uh, see anything wrong in what we're doing, Feel free to leave a comment below. Uh, correct us, give us some pointers. Uh, we wanna learn. Uh, we just think that this dish is a huge Filipino staple item. If you were to search Filipino foods, adobo would be on top. So we're doing this uh, our Bastos Baboy's way and we're not carnivores, so we're not doing pork. Um, so yeah. Bastos Baboy's family. We uh, made chicken adobo, Bastos Baboy style, which means blind, kind of winging the ingredients. Overall, I think it would taste it pretty good. What do you guys think? It's pretty I good, think so man. Too, man. Chicken breast could have added maybe a little more soy sauce. Um, and then some of the special ingredients we got some, from some of our buddies, uh, like maybe brown sugar. What yeah. else? Brown sugar. Um, Sealy. 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 A little spice. But and that's just plain silly. <laughs> <laughs> but, but other than that, it went pretty well. So um, very good, very delicious. So. so if you guys like the video, like the video, hit the notification bell and smash that notification bell so you stay up to date. So <laughs> you can stay up to date on when we post new videos. Until next time, oh, we're going to